Hello everyone, welcome to another tutorial. In this tutorial, I will try to show you how to download topographic maps like this from the online topographic map collection source of the University of Texas. To do this, I am going to make use of the global Earth application over here. Basically, to view the availability of the topographical map across the globe and pick the right one that we might potentially be interested in. And right over here, you can see a map that I have downloaded already for the regional covering Los Angeles in the United States. And you can see these maps are fairly comprehensive in the terms of contents. And these are basically printed version of the published topographic maps which are then scanned and now made available via this digital content. Alright, so without further delay, let's jump right into the tutorial and I'll show you guys how we can download this kind of map for an area that's of the interest to us. So what I am going to do this, I am going to open an internet browser and write use army maps dot kmz over here use army maps dot kmz over here and hit enter now as i revealed to you guys this data is actually saved in this online topography map collection source of the university of texas libraries website click over here and you will see that should initiate the downloading process over here and the file gets downloads will be in user me mass v underscore 17 file which can be read in the kmz file format go to your downloaded desired folder make sure that you guys you have to install google Earth pro software now open it by using google Earth pro application i am going to double click on this file and going to open this KMZ file using Google Earth Pro and when it's download this it's look like this as you can see over here we have a quite number of gears carrying quite a large area across the entire globe and if you see right over here you can see the different like scales from the scale 1 to 250,000 then the scale from 1 to 1 million and the scale from 1 to 2 million now the areas which are constrained by these small pieces are corresponding to scale from 1 to 250,000 if I uncheck this, you can see that set of grid sets disappeared and if we talk about a scale of 1 to 1 million, you can see that it's mostly referring to the grids which are represented by the pink color and as you can see, we have another level of coverage with a scale of 1 to 2 million which are basically these are large grids. So this pink color is represented as a world grid and this green color represents as a africa grid this is the large grid so you can narrow down your size simply with the addition of these checkboxes and for being this tutorial i am going to neutralize all of these other options and I'm going to only initiate these maps which are at a scale of 1 to 250,000. So check this one. And as you can see, once we narrow down the source, the availability also get reduced. And after that, we can simply navigate to a place that's of interest to us. Let's say if I would like to download a map corresponding to the region of the Los Angeles of the United States. Uh, for this, uh, go to search bars and type Los Angeles over here. Then hit the enter. You 
you can see some sort of annotation over here click on this and that open up this kind of a dialog box and to view this map you can either click on this map hyperlink that uh, that you can see over here but here i found to be a bit troublesome so the work around that i found was simply we can write over here on this blue color map hyperlink and we can copy that link and we can separately open up an internet browser for your choices after that we can simply paste that link and simply hit the enter and just in a matter of few seconds you will be able to view the topographical map like this and these maps are quite high in resolution for example if you zoom in you can see that it's a quite detailed and you can scroll around like this to examine the information and you can see the topographical control lines along with this other information and if you want to save the file you have to do is simply right click over here and you can select save images as navigate to your working folder and i am going to name this as los angeles click on save you can see the downloaded topographic may have right over here go to your desired folder for opening this double click on this it's getting downloaded as a jpg file and when we are zooming in you can see that we are not really losing any quality as these maps are quite high in terms of its resolution even though if it happened to be a scan maps all right so before we conclude the tutorial let me go ahead and open up google app pro once more I will try to download another topographic map which is corresponding to a different region. Let's say if I navigate to the region of the Dhaka of Bangladesh. So for this go to here, right here as the name of Dhaka, Bangladesh, hit the enter button of the keyboard. then click on this grid number one then right click over here and copy the hyperlink of this map open your browser then paste the link over here and hit enter and this map particularly take a bit more long time than the others just because of its size as it quite high in terms of the its resolution as you can see over here so again what i am going to do this i am going to right click over here and i am going to save this image and going to name this as dhaka topography map then click on save the download has been started over here you can see the downloaded topographic map right over here go to my desired download folder double click on this for opening now you can see that it's also getting a downloaded as a jpg file and when we are zooming in you can see that we are not really losing any quality as these maps are quite high in terms of its resolution even though if it happened to be a scan maps 
all right friends so i guess that's about it for this tutorial and i hope the tutorial was quite helpful for you guys if you did like this tutorial please don't forget to give it a like comments and share it with your friends and if you would like to see this kind of interesting js related tutorials on a tablet basis don't forget to click the subscribe button as well as and you will get notified immediately as soon as i upload a new video on this channel see you again in another tutorial thank you and have a good day